Today, kind of the opposite uh, direction that we're heading. Now, we've got more cloud cover this morning than we did yesterday afternoon, but we've also got very little in the way of rain. That is subject to change, and you can see it creeping around the uh, bottom of the screen there. Uh, these showers that have been trying to work their way in across Tennessee border and having limited success, well, eventually they are going to push north as a wave of low pressure does the same. This is the very same low that was with us Monday uh, out across western Kentucky, kind of cruised south, stalled. Now you can see it gradually creeping back north again, and that precipitation is going to come with it. So our rain chance is going to be on the rise, especially from noon on from the southeast off to the uh, west. It'll wrap in around that approaching low and we could see some wraparound effect into your Friday as well. So active weather still with us as it has been all work week. Here's the future track and quite a bit of cloud cover and this is noon one, two, three, four, around five o'clock that main slug of rain coming in with some isolated thunder showers possible as well and then uh, scattered showers, isolated thunder showers throughout the evening. It'll be very hit or miss. So you may catch some nice, you know, breaks in the activity. You get an hour or two without much going on and then you have another passing shower. So it's not going to be an all out rain, but there will be distinct waves of it. And then into Friday is that low pools northeast will have these wraparound scattered showers, thunder showers. You can see that low gradually working its way up to the northeast. So hopefully by Saturday we should be more or less done with it. We'll keep a very low end chance for a little bit of active weather in Saturday. Rainfall amounts heaviest yesterday out to the west, but uh, we did see anywhere from a quarter of an inch to about a half an inch on the high end from some of those showers that went through. And it's a very similar setup with these next couple of rounds coming in today and tomorrow. Hit or miss. You could literally have trace amounts to hundreds of an inch to almost an inch of rain if you have a couple of waves go through. So watch out for that. And of course, cloud cover keeping the temperature suppressed. We're in the low to mid 70s. We'll be in the 80s this weekend. Quick update on the tropics. Still not a lot of uh, changes there. Brett has strengthened a little bit, but it's encountering uh, some unfavorable conditions over the next couple of days. Uh, so that tropical storm is going to run into some uh, wind shear there, and it could very well weaken it. And uh, the next one behind it would be named Cindy. So there's a possibility that the next wave coming in uh, will very well uh, be a named storm as well. National Hurricane Center's got bred up to 70 mile per hour sustained winds, but is dropping it down to 45 mile per hour winds by Saturday. That second wave that I was talking about, potential Cindy there, looks like it'll curve off into the Atlantic. So at this point, neither of them are a threat to the U.S. as of right now. Low to mid 70s, scattered showers, thunder showers, a few uh, showers and storms hanging on overnight. Uh, so that active weather really gets going later in the afternoon into the evening, and then we'll see additional scattered showers, a few thunder showers Friday. So still a bit of active weather to start the weekend off. Look at the temperature climb though, from the low to mid 70s today to the mid to upper 70s tomorrow to the mid to upper 80s Saturday into Sunday. The heat is on. And if you've been, uh, you know, really wanting a pool day for the kids and have had difficulty finding one this week, no surprise. Uh, looks like Saturday afternoon should be OK. Sunday could be even better with the heat and mostly sunny skies. It'll be a close call, though, because we'll have another chance for showers and storms firing up early next week. Right now, we're going to try to keep it pushed off until Monday.